Master of Economic Science in European Public Affairs and Law has been around for many years. It used to be intimately connected to UCD's Dublin European Institute, which has now been amalgamated within UCD's School of Politics and International Relations. Many of our alumni and graduates from that program over the years from the late 90s into the early 2000s have gone on to develop very successful academic, diplomatic and political careers in the European Union. So the program has a long history and a deep embeddedness and is widely known in the international space of European politics, so it has a very powerful brand. Over time it has adapted, has evolved in response to the change in dynamics of the type of graduates we get, but what is defining characteristic of the program is that it focuses on economics, politics and law. And the expectation is that students learn those three aspects of European politics and policy because those three aspects of European politics and policy are indispensable for really understanding how this very complex multi-level policy works. I think we underestimate you know, how important it is, the tactical experience or the tangible experience that we get from living in a particular country. And then when you come together in a classroom, you learn about, oh, the differences in your welfare state looks like this, oh, your labor market operates like this, oh, the employment structure in your country operates like this, oh, the challenge for the European Union is the diversity of these different models and growth models. So having that real experience of different students from different countries really uh, enhances the quality of the debate and discussion in the classroom. Many of our students go on to work in the European Union itself. Many of our students have gone to work for various organisations, lobby groups, regulatory authorities, trade associations in Brussels, Frankfurt and further afield. Some of our students go on to work more domestically in Ireland in various government departments, in international organisations or organisations and institutions focused on international and European public affairs. So the, the career profile is very diverse. Uh, a lot of it depends on you know, the type of interest that the particular student has. If they want to uh, you know, move towards another city, well, I, I think in all probability they will, and this programme gives them good experience to go on to develop uh, those skills in the labour market. So I've been working in finance for the past eight, nine years and I've had really good opportunities but there's always just been this thing in my mind, I'd prefer to work in politics and policy and um, I said I need to kind of get some new knowledge first before I take that plunge. Um, so that's, that's why I came back. You know, a year out from the professional work world, it's not that long. The way the semesters work, they've just gone so fast. My job would always be there if I wanted to go back. The first few weeks can be challenging with the readings and all that kind of and getting back into academic thinking. But, you know, after Christmas, it just becomes so easy and you just you kind of you don't want your time to end.